Why, hello. As you can see, we have some new recording facilities while the kitchen is being remodeled. It's also the reason we've moved to an every other week schedule, which means we're a little behind on some of the summer stuff since autumn is already here. So today we have three Pop-Tart varieties that were summer specials. The Tropical Mango, the Peach Cobbler, and the Lemon Cream Pie. Should we start with tropical mango? One problem with pop tarts is that the silver packages are always identical. So if you make the mistake of combining them into one box, you have no idea what you're going to get. Maybe that's a feature, not a bug. Ooh, tropical mango. So it's pretty plain actually. There's um, very little frosting on this. It's just the drizzle on top. Oh, let's see. Very mango flavored. Not bad. Because it's not coated in frosting, it's not super sweet. It's also not very strongly flavored. These aren't bad at all. If you like mango, it tastes just like really like a mango jelly. It's not weird or different or there's no over and over. It's pretty much just like a mango jelly. So if you like mango, these are probably worth a worth a go. Peach cobbler. And actually, I love peach cobbler. I'm very hopeful for this one, but you know how that works out on this channel. This one has a little more frosting. It's not edge to edge, which is strange. I'm not sure why they just frosted the center piece of it. I also feel like the crust part is much deeper, like they're saving money on the filling. As expected, I'm disappointed. These don't taste like peach hardly at all, much less like peach cobbler. It's a very generalized just sweetness. If I were you, I'd probably take a pass on these, especially if you're looking for peach cobbler, because you will be disappointed. <clears throat> oh well. Last, but not least, lemon cream pie. I like lemon, but unfortunately, as we've experienced, some of this stuff comes out tasting like pledge. Here we have the most generous amount of frosting yet. And still miraculously, it looks like it was put on by a kindergartner. I, I'm not sure how after so many years of production, the Pop-Tarts people can't figure out how to evenly put... <laughs> Maybe that's intended to be part of the charm. Hmm. This is not bad. Not too pledge-like. Tastes a lot like lemon cream, lemon cream pie. Oh, um, I'd actually say it's more like lemon meringue pie, which is... I don't know, they do have a picture of a lemon cream pie, but... I would call it lemon meringue, but we're kind of splitting here since it's still a pop tart. If you like lemon, these are definitely these are definitely worth a go. Not bad at all. Since the kitchen is being rebuilt, we will not bother to heat these up since they have to go downstairs. And guys, I'm not sure any of these would benefit or detract from getting heated, except maybe the peach collar, which is the most disappointing of them. So, you know, we're going to give the mango and the lemon cream pie straight up fours. They're, you know, they, they don't get to five because it's still Pop-Tart and the crust on a Pop-Tart is you know, just kind of uninspired. Peach cobbler on the other hand, I'm going to have to give a one because, you know, partly that's just from being extremely disappointed in what, what I was hoping for. Well, there you have it. Trying to hit up the last of the summer stuff before summer's completely gone and you can't find these things. But if they bring them around some other year, then you can rewatch the video then. Like and subscribe and ring the notification bell to be notified of new videos. And as always, if there's anything you want me to try so you don't have to, just let me know.